It's not just ethanol that those tariffs are affecting either. An Iowa State University study finding that those new international tariffs could cost Iowa's economy up to $2 billion. Marcus McIntosh breaks down those numbers. Is that a lot? Yeah, it's a lot. It's a big number. But it's, I, I probably would have been more surprised had it said something like 10 to 20 percent. Crespi, Iowa State University professor and interim director of the Center for Agricultural and Rural Development, says the study breaks down the potential hit by industry. Ethanol producers could lose $105 million, the corn industry between $90 million and $579 million, and the hog industry faces losses of $558 million to $955 million, and the soybean industry faces losing between $159 million and $891 million. Not surprised by the findings. Kirk Leeds is the CEO of the Iowa Soybean Association. He says the dollar and sixty cents a bushel pledged to soybean farmers by the government helps but does not come close to the bailout that would come from settling the trade war with China. The tariffs and the counter tariffs that we're enduring in this trade war between China and the United States is having a real impact on Iowa farmers. The CEO of the Iowa Pork Producers Association says that is what his industry is asking for, a quick resolution. For the pig farmers, the producers, it's certainly a very difficult economic time and we're looking at uh, or asking for a quick resolve to these trade disputes. Um, and for sure with Mexico to get that market opened up as quickly as possible. As the report was coming out, authors of the study are aware of another round of possible tariffs against China, but also a strong dialogue and movement in negotiations with Mexico.